make sure that I don't have jewelry. My my hands are my nails are big from uh, nail polish, no fats. And then it's clean. Rinse. Then I need to make sure that it's dry. Um, hello, good afternoon. My name is Mark. I am your nurse for today. How are you? I'm fine. You're fine. Okay. Um, can you tell me your full name? My, my name is Albert Tan. Albert Tan. And how about your date of birth? My date of birth is 1st June 1915. 1st June 1915. Can I check your ID band? Yes. Okay. So it is um, Albert Tan. June 1st, 1915, your hospital number is 01742. Okay. How should I address you? You can call me Albert. Okay, Albert. So, Albert, I am here because I need to collect uh, urine in your catheter okay. uh, for a sample and for your test as ordered by your doctor. Is, is that all right? Yeah. Okay. But first of all, do you have any pain right now? No. Yeah, okay. You don't have pain. Okay. How about any allergies to medicines, latex? No. 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 Okay. Uh, are you comfortable right now? Yes. Okay. Is it okay if I can change your position into flat? Yeah. Okay. Thank you so much. So I'll just position you in flat, okay? And then, um, Albert, I will uh, plug the, the catheter. Okay? Is that alright? Yeah. I will just uh, do my hand at it for the meantime. And then, uh, wear my gloves and apron. Is that alright? Yeah. That's okay. How is your hmm? difficult patient? <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Pace is difficult earlier. Did you eat your lunch already then? Um, Albert? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I'm not bad. Albert? No, yes, I did. Okay. So, Albert, is it okay if I will just expose the catheter? Does it have to be now? Yeah. Because okay. I will uh, just remove the, I will just yes. clamp the catheter, okay? okay. Okay, uh, now I can see that the tubings are uh, free from uh, urine and it's uh, visible. So I will be clamping the catheter using a uh, non traumatic clamp and uh, it will be in the distal part of the catheter. Okay? So it's already clamped. So uh, I will just remove my gloves and throw it in the clinical waste bin and my egg. And my apron from the clinical waste bin. So I will go back uh, after 15 minutes. You may feel fullness in your bladder. That's normal. If you cannot bear anymore, just uh, try to call me, okay? Then I will just do my NIG. Then I will uh, need to prepare my um, equipment. Uh, I need to wear another apron and then gloves um, I assume that my tray is already clean with water and soap uh, within the 24 hours but to make it sure I will clean again with uh, clean and wipes uh, from farthest to nearest using zigzag then I need to make sure that uh, I will dry it so that it will be safe for me to use. Then just throw this one and then my apron. Then do my hand hygiene again. So now I will uh, be uh, gathering my equipment. First, I need a syringe. I, need, I can see that it's intact and the expiration is uh, February 2024. I will be needing uh, two alcohol pads. I can see that it's also intact and the expiration is uh, April 2021. Uh, I will be needing a urine container. I need to make sure that it is sterile and it's intact. And then I will be needing a uh, uh, in incontinent sheet for my patient and then uh, 
plastic uh, bag for transferring the urine container later for the sample. And then that's it. And the request for the laboratory. Now uh, I will uh, do my hygiene. Then I need to prepare my. I need to go to my patient now. But first, I need. I will wear my apron. So uh, I'm back. Then I need to provide privacy already again to my patient. I already make sure that the housekeeping activities are uh, stuck. So I'm back. Um, can you tell me your name again? My name is Albertan. Albertan, and your uh, date of birth? Uh, 3rd June 1950. Can I check your ID band? Yeah. Okay, that's great. So now I will uh, be collecting uh, the sample. I need to wear gloves. It's okay. <laughs> oh, I, know that I assume that I already wear my gloves properly. Then, uh, now I will put the uh, incontinence sheet. Albert, is it okay if you can lift your backside for me? I will just put the into sheet. Okay. okay. Then, uh, I will just expose the catheter again. Is that all right? Yeah, that's all. Okay, then I will clean it with, uh, I will clean the uh, something port with alcohol, uh, swab for 30 seconds and then dry it for 30 seconds. Okay. So, Albert, uh, this sample will be sent uh, after my procedure into uh, to laboratory, okay? okay. Uh, the doctor might uh, change the course of your treatment. Maybe he will change the antibiotic. Are you receiving antibiotic? No. No. Okay. But maybe the doctor wants to check only if there's any infection. Okay? Yeah. Then I will throw this one into the clinical waste bin and then make sure that I will make uh, dry it for another 30 seconds. So, oh, a while ago, you said that you already eat your lunch. Do you have any special diet? No. No, you're eating everything. Yeah, eating okay. Everything. Are you happy with the uh, the meal served they have served to you? Yeah. Okay, that's good. Do you have any requests for your dinner so I can tell to the uh, kitchen uh, personnel? No, she yeah. be Okay. She okay. I will be noting. Now I will uh, collect the urine sample. Okay. okay. I need to make sure that I will get ten. Uh, 10 ml, then since it's needleless, no, there's no need for the uh, needle, then I will put uh, put this uh, syringe into 90 degrees. Is that alright? Yeah, okay. So, it's uh, 10 ml. I need to make sure that I will not attach the tape of the syringe, mm -hmm. then I will transfer this one. Uh, in the urine sample container, make sure that I will not touch the inside the container, and then throw this one into clinical waste in the syringe. Then I need to make sure that it is completely covered and sealed. Okay. Now I will be cleaning again with uh, alcohol swab the sample port for uh, 30 seconds. So uh, uh, I will send this one once I'm done with the procedure. Probably the result will take one to two hours and then the doctor will let you know the result or if there's any additional treatment he will add in the course of your plan. Is that all right? Yeah. Okay.
Yeah. Okay, then I need to make to drag it for 30 seconds. So this one is going to take a waste beam. So I can see in the urine, in your urine that it is normal in color. It's not cloudy and you can see that it's not concentrated. So that's a good thing. So hopefully we'll just get the result uh, normal. Okay? Then I need to make sure that uh, I will put this one in the uh, plastic bag and make sure that it's uh, sealed together with the uh, microbiology um, request. I need to throw the other materials in the clinical waste bin and since the 30, se 30 seconds is already over, I will just unclamp uh, the um, catheter and I will remove your, can you leave your backside for me again? We'll just remove this one. Okay. Then we'll throw this one to clinical waste bin. Cover you. Then I will just remove my gloves. And my apron. So Albert, do you need anything? No, I'm fine. Okay. I will be back. I will just do my documentation. I need to make sure that uh, I, I I need to write that I already obtained the blood uh, the urine sample okay. and I can I will also write the uh, consistency of your urine okay um, if you have anything just, this is the call then just uh, try to press if you have any problem okay and then uh, I will be back after 30 minutes just to check you okay so I will be sending now this uh, sample to laboratory but before leaving I need to do my final hygiene.